We're going to show you 13 mind-blowing video editing tricks, all using CapCut on desktop. We were surprised to find out that CapCut even had a desktop app, and even more surprised to find out the unbelievable stuff it can do. The tips at the end of this video are going to blow your mind. Let's go. One of the wildest things you can do inside CapCut is change a subject's skin tone. Under video, go to the Enhance tab and select Face. Then just select the new skin tone you want. You can even adjust the warmth and degree of the effect. You can actually slow down any footage even if it wasn't shot in a high frame rate. Under speed, just pull the slider down to something like half speed. Then check the smooth slow-mo box and select optical flow. When it's done processing, you'll have a beautifully slowed down clip in just a few seconds. If you need to make your content available for different platforms, you can automatically crop horizontal clips into vertical aspect ratios for social media, all while keeping your subjects in frame. Just select all your clips, go to video, basic, and then down to auto reframe and click the checkbox. Then just select which aspect ratio you want from the drop down menu. We're going to do 9 by 16 to create a vertical video. Then you can even select your level of image stabilization and the camera movement speed. Then just hit apply and CapCut will do the rest for you. If you want to create a dreamy 70s look, add the Gleam video effect. Then under adjustment on your clip, tweak the highlights to change how dramatic the effect looks. This trick is truly unbelievable. Inside CapCut, you can actually manipulate the appearance of your subject's body. With your clip selected, just go to Video and then Enhance. Then check the box labeled Body. This allows you to manipulate everything, including shoulders, arms, waist, and even breast and butt enhancements. If you have a shaky shot you want to smooth out, just select the clip, go up to Video, then Basic, and select Stabilize. If you don't like the recommended settings, you can choose between Minimum Cut, which crops your shot as little as possible, or Most Stable, which gives you the smoothest clip possible. If you want to create a trippy, surreal look, just add the Rainbow Haze video effect to your shots. This one also works well if you increase the highlights on the clip. Most people don't realize you can turn low quality clips into HD or Ultra HD right inside CapCut on desktop. Just select the clip and under video select basic and then image enhancement. Choose the quality you want and then just let it do its thing and improve your clip right before your eyes. You can easily simulate handheld camera motion inside CapCut, even if your clip was filmed on a tripod. Just add the play pendulum video effect above your clips, bring down the strength to create the right amount of subtlety in the movement, then adjust the sliders for speed and sharpen to get just the right look. You can easily remove video flicker from your clips, making otherwise unusable shots perfect for your edit. Just select your clip and under video go to basic and then down to removing video flickers. You can adjust the settings to deal with two main types of flicker, flashlight and time lapse. You can even change the level of the effect for different intensities. If you want to create a stylized retro look for your shots, under effects add the film frame video effect above your clips. Then under filters just add the film effect to your shots and bring down the strength. Lastly under transitions add any of the glare effects to your clips to create beautiful light leak transitions between shots. One incredible trick to save you an enormous amount of time is to save your own presets and assets to a custom brand kit. Just make any adjustments you want and then select add to brand kit. Name your preset whatever you'd like and select the space you want to add it to. Any team members in that group can then access them so you or your team never have to remake assets from scratch. This one is crazy. You can actually add makeup to your subject in post. Under video, just go to enhance and check the makeup box. You can add things like eyeliner, lipstick, mascara, and even things like freckles and contact lenses. Most people are surprised that all these features are in the desktop version of CapCut and they keep adding new ones all the time. So go try them out yourself at the link in the description and make something amazing with them. We'll see you in the next one.